So today we're going to be eating at Poppy's of Camden. This was a um, recommendation from Allison and so we've come down here uh, to make sure that we get some. Okay, Kevin and I got the exact same thing. We got the fish and chips, exactly the same thing this time. Um, and they have, they give you a little pot of ketchup and you get um, tartar sauce. It's not marked, but it's tartar sauce. Okay, we ordered uh, two regular cod fish dinners and it was 23 pounds 40. 26 pounds 32 there is a uh, service charge I'm thinking that's probably a tip is the service charge so I wanted to uh, give you our uh, final thoughts on poppies because I gave you the total and then we we uh, left um, and we didn't uh, we didn't give our final thoughts on it um, honestly for uh, in my opinion I thought, and I know Allison's gonna die because I know Allison loved it. She um, she really thought that it was wonderful. However, I bet Allison has never been to a place called Rose and Crown. If Allison had ever been to Rose and Crown, then she would not think anything at all of poppies. No, poppies taste like something you get over in the United States. I mean, it's it wasn't anything. Poppies to me, to me tasted like Long John Silvers. Yeah, truly, yeah. it tasted like Long John Silvers, and it was greasy like Long John Silvers. It was kind of greasy. Um, yeah, it was a greasy fish. Uh, the chips were they were good, they were hot, but um, they just. Um, and nothing was bad it just wasn't spectacular mm -hmm. like i said long john silvers 10 pounds per meal or 11 something it was actually 11 pounds it was a lot that's, that's a, a lot. lot yeah for what you're getting that is a lot and i'll tell you something else too um and this has nothing to do with the food but the the waitress she brought us in and there were lots of tables and she crowded every person that came in right up in the same group of tables. That's because it made it look like it was really busy inside. And I get that. I get that if um, if they're if they're short on staff. When they're short on staff at restaurants, they try to group the tables together so that that waitress won't have to travel as far. Ooh, that 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 was not the case. Um, <laughs> the window's <laughs> open. <laughs> that was not the case in this place. She. Um, no, they did it to make it look fuller. Yeah, they? she uh, she put us just as close together as she could. But not only did she do that, I haven't even told Kevin about this. She was the whole time that I was eating, she was standing behind Kevin, like literally staring at my every bite that I took. We need to hurry up or what? Well, I, I think so. I well, think the people next to us ate slower than we did. They did. They ate slower, and there were some people that were behind you, and they were sitting at the table. They had finished eating. They had paid, and I could tell it was really just 
killing her that they were still taking up that table, even though there were plenty of tables and no one was coming in. I, it, she just, she just made it uncomfortable. It was just, it was an uncomfortable experience eating there because she st stood there and stared the entire time. And I just don't, there was no reason for her to do that. Um, I, I just totally don't get that. But besides that, even if she had not been there, judging by the food itself, it wasn't that great. So, in my opinion, should you make a special trip to Camden Market to try poppies? No, that's just my opinion. Now, Silke, uh, Silke is our friend that from Germany. She sends us all kinds of stuff from Germany. Um, she ate there, and she thought that it was delicious. But then again, she has not been to Rose and Crown, and I know I've said that, but well, we I had fish and chips at that other place. It was really good. Um, we had fish and chips at a couple places. We had and fish and chips at a couple places. Better. Yes, that we had fish and chips at uh, Ye Old Queen, Cheshire Cheese and the Queen's Arms. The and it was just that yep. Poppy's honestly was at the bottom of the totem pole compared to those other places. So, when you hear me say that the Vision Chips was good at those places, it's really, really good. I promise you, you won't go wrong. So, anyway, um, I'm really glad to Allison for recommending mm -hmm. it to us. If anything, it was, um, it was interesting to go to a different side of town. So, I hope you enjoyed this review, and thanks for watching.